Next we have lot 102, 17-7, crossbred, guilt, tricked out, never before on a Rule 21. Yeah, here 17-7 uh, <clears throat> has been one that we've we've liked pretty good just uh, from a standpoint of, of early bone and but still having femininity. And, uh, you know, she looks like one that, um, you know, you could show as a market guilt if you wanted to, but also a breeding guilt that will always, she's never going to be enormous, enormous one that, you know, I think can, uh, you can you can jackpot her and manage her, her frame pretty easily. Uh, uh, we like And we like those sows, like I said. I know it's a broken record, but it's hard for us, uh, Clay and I both, uh, not to get too too repetitive, just because uh, I have littermate sows I've bred the same way 17 <laughs> times it seems like so, uh, but they all look you know pretty darn similar. Yeah, and that's what you want, uh, and that's why you do it. You wanted the consistency, you wanted the depth, the quality in the litter. Um, this 17 litter, much like uh, a couple of the other litters we talked about on gilts, uh, just buy the one you like, buy the one you think you're going to want to feed, and uh, maybe size wise it'll fit your your window and and be happy and and roll with it, and either sell them and cash in and make a lot of money after the show or put them in the sow herd and uh, and make your sow herd better because i think uh, this whole 17 uh, litter gilt uh, i mean just uh, depth of quality is is outstanding so again lot 102 17-7 crossbred gilt